So Master Fu's era has officially ended in Season 3 as he transfers the ownership and duty of guardianship over to Ladybug. And his mistakes of the past had also been resulted in Ladybug's lucky charm and feast. But I think a new plot for Master Fu is actually being planned for the future as a plot twist or could be a part of the entire show. And there is no little to no concrete evidence about this coming ever too, so most of the sayings in this video will be just vague speculation. Now, Master Fu was the last known guardian, and he had accidentally caused the destruction of the Guardian's order in the past. He's the one for which the protagonists were brought up, and now Ladybug's era is the new time for the show's rebirth in a different direction. Yes, Master Fu has done the best as he could, but now as he's gone, it's, now it's time for Ladybug to continue the legacy over Master Fu. So maybe the guardianship distribution, the distribution of the miraculous, making all the decisions, everything's on to Ladybug. But if we just speculate for a while, was Master Fu completely to be blamed for the Guardian's temple destruction? We heard the only Miracle Box remaining was the one staying with Master Fu. But how did a Miraculous get to the United States? And get a look over it. The Miraculous was never belonging to the States. It's actually the French leader Lafayette who gave it to George Washington during the war period or something, as Gabriel speculated. So, a Miraculous was actually never found to be on the US. It's always in the French side. And we also saw in one of my previous videos that I speculated that someone else actually one of the Miraculouses was from France and they were attacking France. Now it could be the German Nazis and the, during the World War and stuff, but why would they even want the Miraculouses? And why did it belong to the French community when the only Miracle Box was Master Fu's Miracle Box? Because the Eagle Miraculous never made it to Master Fu's Miracle Box. It was a separate Miracle Box from the unknown guardian that came from somewhere. So that means somehow or some way, Master Fu was not totally to be blamed for the entire destruction of the temple, right? Or else how would the Eagle Miraculous be stolen from that specific box where it was? Right? So the Master Fu never had the Eagle Miraculous. He never mentioned anything about the Eagle Miraculous being lost. Also, we only saw a glimpse of Master Fu's family, but we never heard of his descendants and his family, which he abandoned years ago. So what if he returns back in the future to fulfill his prophecy? Now what's the prophecy? It's completing what he had actually started. Now we still don't know the exact past of what happened and the why the Guardian's Temple actually got destroyed. Yes, Master Fu did it, but was it before the destruction of the Temple of the Eagle Miraculous or the other Miraculous got lost all over the world? So I think Fu is not 100% to be blamed for the entire destruction and something or someone had been behind it or along with him. And I think Fu is going to be the one who's going to be uncovering the mysteries once again, maybe sometime in the future. It could be near the end of the show, it could be in the Shanghai special. Now the Shanghai special also plays an important role because we will be seeing Marinette's Franco-Chinese origins in the Shanghai special. It was actually confirmed by a Masterclass interview via Thomas Asterix. Uh, I never made a post or a video regarding that because it only contained vague information. But that's the only information we got about the Shanghai special that we're going to be connecting with Marinette. Marinette's Franco-Chinese origins. And also if I have Business Wire and all that that I made a video about, we, we, we know that Marinette's going to be connected to his Franco-Chinese origins. Now, what if Master Fu is actually related to Marinette in some case? We know Marinette's mother is Chinese and, you know, there's a whole back history that's going to be plotted out, but what if somehow Master Fu knows Marinette since the beginning? Maybe he doesn't know it officially unless he realized that Marinette is one of his descendants. It's going to be a really, really good twist and I believe that it's going to be coming in some point because Master Fu has to return. Now, again, I said we have no vague proof that this will ever happen. We just can't speculate that there are ways it can happen. And these are the only two legit ways that I think it will happen more than maybe returning back to get all the Miraculouses. He might take back these Miraculouses and put it into the Guardian's Temple and then end the show forever. But that's most unlikely since now Marin is the new Guardian and there is this new Guardian from Shanghai or somewhere that came in the New York special. So it's pretty vague on he will return back for the Miraculouses. But either he comes back to fulfill his prophecy on who and why the Miracle Temple was destroyed at the first place and how the Miraculous got lost. And second, Masterful might have some connection with Marinette's family and her origins because you know it's just all the Chinese background flow. So what do you guys think? How will Master Fu return and do you have any theories about Master Fu returning back and doing something more evil? Will Master Fu return evil? Vague answer but again put them on the comments and I'd love to read them.